Hey, what's up guys? It's Panda Dipoa here for a new video. You know what? I was really surprised about the number of comments I had onto my different Joy-Con controllers tutorials of people saying that they weren't able to keep connection between their Joy-Con controllers and their PC, meaning that each time they pair their Joy-Con controllers, then turn them off and turn them on again, they weren't able to play. They weren't able to connect again. So I was a little bit surprised about that because on my side it was working perfectly. Then I did what was the most logical thing. I bought a new Bluetooth dongle from Amazon and I received it and I wanted to test what I can do with it. It's a Ugreen Bluetooth dongle 5.0 and I will plug it into my computer and we will see what happens. Here are the Joy-Cons that I will try to connect with the Bluetooth 5.0 Ugreen dongle. Okay, so I plug the dongle right now. The, the icon Bluetooth should appear at the bottom right of your computer. You right click on it and you click on show Bluetooth devices. Then you arrive here, you click on add device and then I will put my left Joy-Con into pairing mode. So I remain pushed on the button in the middle between the SL and SR. It will start blinking and then I click on Bluetooth here and I have the Joy-Con left appearing here. I click on it and it connects. Okay, so, so far so good. Then I will put in pairing mode the same way the right Joy-Con between SL and SR. You have the black button that you have to push for three seconds. It starts blinking. Add device, Bluetooth, and the Joy-Con is appearing here. I click on it, it con it's connecting now, and it's connected. So I have the two Bluetooth Joy-Con controllers appearing here, connected to my PC. It's something that we did already in other videos before. It's remaining connected, so everything is well set up, and you can play whatever you want. Now, I will turn off the two controllers by, click by pushing the, the button in the middle. And now I will try to turn on the controller, and as you can see, it says connected into Windows, into the Bluetooth window here, but in fact, it's not connected properly. And it will do the same for the left controller. So now it says connected, but the connection is not done properly, but it's because, because it's still blinking on, on the side, right? And now I will give you the solution because it's a lot frustrating to have to pair again and again and again your Joy-Con controllers on your PC to be able to play games, right? You just want to push a button and then they are auto reconnecting to your PC. So the solution, if you look for Switch, Nintendo Switch specs, okay? You go there, for instance, on Nintendo.com and you will see here that if you go on wireless, okay, wireless section, you have the Wi-Fi, but the Wi-Fi is not the issue we have right now. You can see that the specs of the chip the Bluetooth chip inside the Nintendo Switch until now has been and is 4.1. So the technology that is used for the Joy-Cons is the Bluetooth 4.1. And we can see that we have some incompatibility between the 4.1 of the Joy-Cons, the Joy-Con controllers and the Bluetooth 5.0 because it's trying to connect two version of the Bluetooth specs there. So the solution, I will just remove my dongle here. The solution is to use a, a Bluetooth dongle 4 to connect your Joy-Con controllers. And we will see right now what is happening if I connecting the dongle Bluetooth 4. So I have an, the new dongle connected there. Uh, I will show you it's a TP-Link. If you want to buy it, it's available on Amazon. It will fix your issues. So I have to remove the uh, Joy-Con already connected before uh, because I have to repair them with the new Bluetooth dongle. So if it's not possible to remove them, you can add device, Bluetooth, and you just have to put your different Joy-Cons in pairing mode, so the left, and it will just override the other one, okay? So now it's connected, and I will do the same for the right controller, so it starts blinking. I will add the Bluetooth, right one, it's done. And now it's time to see if it's working. So I turn off the two Bluetooth controllers, okay? And now I will turn on the right one, it's connected, and it's not blinking. Okay, as you can see, because I am using a Bluetooth 4 dongle, okay? And I will do the same for the left one. 
and as you can see it's not blinking blinking so every time you turn off and turn on your controllers they will work as intended so they will reconnect automatically and even the blue button is on as you can see so your controllers are connected that's it guys i hope it will help you fix your controller joycon controllers issue because it was hell on my side i was curious about finding a solution and i think it's the good solution for you because finally the console is working with bluetooth 4 version and apparently the joycon controllers also work with the bluetooth 4 version don't forget forget to subscribe, like the video, and I have a bunch of videos coming to help you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Take care.